Hello beautiful people and welcome back to Symptopia. My name is Storm and today we're on episode 7, no, episode 8 of Rags to Riches. And since the update, my CC has now been removed. Okay, listen, I don't know why she's like starving to death because I can see her ribs. But anyway, we are going to be dressing her in the outfit that she now does not have now that she's in the nude. And I just want to state that we have already deducted her for these kind of outfits so we're just going to be reusing the outfits and putting makeup on because she her makeup is also just gone so it's, it's sad her eyes also need to be changed again oh goodness me guys the updates has just conflicted with a bit of things so we're just going to put some new makeup on her and make her all beautiful again if you don't know we do um, charge our sims for makeup and all that which we already did with our CC but obviously we're not we don't have CC anymore so yeah now we're just changing everything back to normal just to the um, Sims items so that's perfectly fine I think she looks cute already we're getting at least somewhere so yes if you guys don't know I do upload every day and this is part of our rags to riches challenge we're having so much fun with Giselle Fletcher I'm not going to repeat this um, story each episode I just think that's a little bit of too much um, if you guys are interested in finding out about the challenge you're more than welcome to watch the first episode where we lay out the backstory a little bit and we just tell you a little bit more about Giselle herself and where she comes from and how she came to be in Oasis Springs so last episode we had the misfortune of trying to find someone that would be interested in us and it seemed that Giselle was never going to find love. So in this episode we really do want to try the, I think we want to try the, um, what do you call that, oh my goodness, I'm losing my words again guys because I'm trying to think and do something and it's not, it's not working for me. So <laughs> we're going to try and do the new sim challenge. I think it's going to be really cool. I think it's Friend of the Neighborhood or something like that. Yes, um, so we're going to do that this episode. I think we'll start that challenge. And hopefully through the adventure of doing such things, we will find, you know, a husband or some sort of something. Because we can't just be alone forever. And I feel like our starter home is now beautifully set up. So we can actually move forward in... In relationships we can definitely do something there uh, it's just been tragedy so we're just hoping that Giselle gets something you know shame she deserves to be happy and at this moment she's not very happy so I'm just gonna charge her like 300 bucks for this if you guys think that's too little or too much just let me know down in the comments below so we're just gonna say the shopping excursion cost 300 bucks I also want to give her a new hairstyle because I feel like she's been rocking this hairstyle for a really long time and maybe maybe that's what's uh, getting the guys you know maybe that's why she's losing interest in all these people so I think maybe we should just change it up a little bit so, um, or maybe we just go for a hair dye I don't know let's let's see what we can come up with let's see what suits her hmm uh, I don't like that. I mean, this is like my default hairstyle to go to with any sim. And I don't want to do those default generic hairstyles. I want to try something a little bit different. Uh, There's nothing really that I like. I never really play with short hair because I don't personally like my own... Like, I mean, I don't like my own hair short. So, But maybe she does. Maybe Giselle likes her hair short. Maybe she went to go get a cut. And no, I don't like that either. So let's see these medium hairstyles. I mean, I kind of like that. That's kind of cute. Maybe if we just gave her a little bit lighter. Maybe she went a shade lighter. Maybe she went blonde. Gray. No, I don't think she'd go gray though. Um, I kind of like that pink though, but I think it's just a bit too much. Too much in your face. Okay, let's try this one. I. I kind of like, I don't know, okay, no, I'm not in that style. I don't like it in that. I don't want to go too weird. I mean, I like that red. That red is actually kind of cute. I don't think I usually go for that red. I like, like, a more natural red. But, I mean, I'm not Giselle. And Giselle is, you know, whoever she is. We are just, I'm sorry, this is taking me so long to find a damn hairstyle. 
Gosh, we're five minutes. Oh, there we go. I think that's perfect. I love that hairstyle so much. We are going to put that on every single hairstyle now. Ooh, I love this. So we have a lady that works with us and she has the most beautiful red hair that is curly and I'm like, I absolutely love her hair. It's like this wild, crazy hair and I think it's really pretty. It's absolutely beautiful. Okay, cool. So this is Giselle. I actually want to get her a new outfit as well. So she has bought this outfit, so we're going to keep this outfit. I think maybe we'll just give her a second outfit, just something else to choose from. Maybe she wants to uh, tone it down a little bit and have like a chill outfit. That's just too much chill. Oh, I like, I love this. Okay, let's just, I don't really wear this because I don't wear it in real life. So I feel like we make fashion choices on things that we would like in real life. Okay, I don't, I would never wear something like this. So we are going to wear this. I think that's, um, oh, I love that emerald green. I think we just go for the darker green and maybe like a skin tight jean. I mean, I think that looks cute. So we'll change these to black shoes. Okay, I think that looks cute. I don't know. Probably doesn't, but okay. I, I never said I was a fashion person, so we're just sticking with it. Okay, so we've edited who she is. Let's uh, continue with our lovely Giselle Fletcher and see what she's up to today. Let's see. Let's see where we're at. Oh, yeah, we were cleaning and making our house undisgusting. So she's in wet clothes. Can we change out of our wet clothes? What are we going to change into? We'll repair it. I don't... Oh, I like the fact that it like just changed into her secondary outfit already. That's really cool. So, we need that. We need you to clean that. We also need you to start baking. So we can have another bake cell. I also want to see what the friend of the... the neighborhood uh, requirements are. I think it all, I can't remember what it's called. I think it's a friend of the neighborhood. So where would we see that? Where would we see challenges? Ew, what do we have in here? We have eggs and toast. Well, I guess you could eat that again. So we'll just put it in the fridge and sell these items. Wonderful. Okay, let's throw it. Can I just dump that in there? Cool. So I don't think we have anything. We have quite a bit of money. Oh yeah, I need to um, quickly remove that. So testing sheets on, and then money. You'll make it two thousand three hundred. So she paid three hundred and ten dollars. Cool for the, her new outfits. I think that's fair. I don't think there's anything in here yet, still or yet whatever. No, there's nothing in there. So she is baking. She's going right ahead and baking. And let's just get some. Clean out spoiled food. Do we not have leftovers at all? So we will need to cook something for ourselves. Let's not bake again. Let's serve lunch and make some mac and cheese. Also, like, where is this? There we go. The positivity challenge. The household has collected zero or four positivity pots. Posters. To participate in the challenge, use your sim cell phone, select the social tab, and then call Millie Bobby Brown, the event coordinator. When Millie Bobby Brown arrives, speak with her to learn about the positivity challenge that is taking place. Okay, so we've got, we need four posters. We've got 20 days and six hours. So let us phone, call event coordinator, or, um, I'm pretty sure it said call event coordinator, right? Use your sim cell phone, select the social, and then call Millie Bobby Brown. Go okay, so chat with. I don't find Millie Bobby Brown. So. Call event coordinator, maybe? Because they did say she is the event coordinator. So let's uh, check that out. Oh, we are on baking level 5, guys. That is. That is amazing. We are getting places. I don't know why you're putting it there. There's a table like right there with nothing on it. Also, we need to breed our frogs so we can get some more money. Money is going to be amazing. So I know that we, um, <clears throat> I put a poll on Twitter, if you didn't know, 
and we had a vote on what the next video was going to be and it was tied between a let's play that was in first person or a new build so the only thing with the first person thing is i've been playing around with a lot of the new update features for the last few days and it's i mean it's okay the only problem is i'm slightly motion sick so ooh, there we go can we invite her in ask about the positivity challenge okay so let me continue with what i was saying so the thing is i'm slightly motion sick so when i tried it out uh, the, over the last few days i realized that it wasn't actually just going to work for me to do that because i was oh okay the positivity challenge requires you perform an assortment of kind generous and sweet tasks for other sims be friendly towards other sims or perform helpful deeds for your neighbors anything that spreads the positive energy after completing a stage of the aspiration be sure to open the box of kindness to receive a reward okay well thank you very much that is not very informative but anyway we shall we shall continue on and see what happens so we need to perform nice tasks for our neighbors so let's maybe let's go talk to someone and see what we can do to spread the positivity okay she's not really stopping and we're still eating and we need fun so let's just can we cancel you can you stop eating how about that because you're like full anyway so <clears throat> let's go find someone <clears throat> so friendly introduction let's go see what we can do for margarita greer No, Kingo, we don't want you to come over. You are wasting our time and our love, and you are just annoying us. So we don't, we don't actually care for you. So we need to spread the positivity. We need to do something nice for her. Let's talk heartfelt com compliment. Let's brighten your day. We can flatter you. Um, let's... Uh, tell a funny story let's maybe let's see if, no I don't want to flirt with you because you have no hair and I think that's just a cast problem so friendly ask to stargaze we're stargaze it's 8 p.m. but it's so bright is this is this my game that's just doing this well I actually just realized that that's very weird so let's friendly introduction Katrina I can't believe we don't even know each other but you're in my house all the time which is really weird okay but do you not like art chavis so let's tell a funny story discuss interest let's ask about career so we want to be friendly as friendly as possible ask to stargaze share photos flirt I mean, he's cute. He's kind of cute. Oh, it's Chavis. We're not going. We're not saying goodbye. We are going to chat here. No, you're not going to say goodbye. You're going to stargaze with me. How about we stargaze? Um, do you want to stargaze or do you want to talk all day? Ask to hang out. Okay, it's getting dark finally at 9 p.m. It's very interesting that it does that. I don't know. It's, I've never noticed that before. Let me know down below if you go if it has been like that before. We'll ask you to hang out afterwards. So let's just have some fun because her fun is so dead. Okay, um... How about we ask you to hang out? Do you wanna... Do you wanna come hang out with us? At our place? Okay, cool. Let's describe a new idea. Talk about our dreams. Let's hug you. Let's see if you're into us. So let's uh, let's flirt with you a little bit. She's very inspired, and he's very focused. Uh, we'll flirt with you and see how it goes. Deep conversation. Let's talk about our dreams. You know, I dream of finding love. Do you know this? And he's like, well, I dream of going to space. 
So discuss fine cuisine. Ask if single. Compliment appearance. Let's hope this guy this works, guys. This might not work because apparently she's completely unlovable. But now with her new hairstyle, you know, who knows? Who knows if she like if he like? Come on, do you, he likes it, guys? Oh my goodness! He likes this. Where are you going? You're supposed to be hanging out with us. Oh, are you coming with us? Okay, so let's just um. Let's go watch TV together. So let's go watch TV and, you know, whatever. Oh, he's flirty. Oh, guys. He is flirty. And he's coming into our house. Ooh, so how about we make out on this couch? So let's whisper sweet nothings. Mm, guys. Yay. This is so awesome. I am so happy for them. Come on, come on, come on. Let's see the love, guys. Let's see that love. Come on, come on. Make a move. Make a move. Do it. Come on, come on. Oh, guys, they're flirting. I'm so excited. Okay, so I want you to go, like kiss him or something. Let's have our first kiss. Oh no, what did you do? First kiss. Come on. Let's do this, guys. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh no, we missed it. Oh, we missed it. Okay, guys. I But I think that this is, this is such a good sign. Oh my goodness. So let's kiss you again. Let's kiss your hands. Let's do a offer a rose and let's do five to stay the night. Let's see what this looks like. Okay. Uh, oh, wow. Um, oh, this is beautiful, guys. Oh, I'm so excited. We are finally... Let's ask him to be our boyfriend. We've just met him, but we're going to woohoo with him. Okay, let's go. Oh god. Oh jeez. Okay. She is so excited and they are officially I think oh jeez, I can't do this guys. This is like so weird. Okay, let's um let's give them some privacy while they woohoo. Oh guys, we have a boyfriend. I am so darn excited. Yay. Okay, we're going to give them some privacy. I just I find it weird. Anyway, guys, we have at least progressed in this episode, and we have a boyfriend. So, well done, Giselle. You actually found someone to love, and I'm very happy for you because you needed that. Girl, you definitely needed some love in your life because you had absolutely nothing. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Oh, you guys are probably like, what is wrong with this weirdo? Like, why is she being so weird? Also, we're going to make sure that no one eats our damn stuff. So we are going to open this quickly and view inventory. And let's open this. More choices open. Okay, let's put all the delicious baked goods in our... Um, because we've got eggs and toast, mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. We only have four baked goods. Oh, but anyway. We'll, oh, no, no. I don't want you to put that in your inventory. I want to put this in the inventory. Okay, cool. Let's sell one of these. So, okay, cool, cool, cool. So exciting. Okay, she's starving, and he's sleeping. Guys, are um, what the hell? He is bald, guys. <laughs> no. Oh my goodness. He was wearing the space suit. We didn't really see what he looked like at all. This is a lesson. This is a lesson. Okay. The lesson is this. You cannot judge someone on their appearances. So, Art Chavez is now in love with our beautiful Giselle. And you know what? I don't mean it in a bad way that he's bald. But I just, you know, I, ex I just expected a different life for her. But this is the life that we have. And this guy finally 
we got someone to love her and I'm not I'm not gonna be upset about that guys I'm not I'm not we are finally moving up in the world we have a boyfriend who might become a husband we're gonna sell this bake. we're gonna do this bake sale and then afterwards we're gonna see how much money we have left and I think we're gonna upgrade the house a little bit so that he can come and move in with us because we definitely want to you know we want to move up and we want to carry on with her story and we want to get her closer to her goal and I think the only way to do that is to get married and she'll be a lot happier. She won't feel like this existence is just her working to do nothing. You know? You know what I mean, guys? I'm so... Oh, I just find that hilarious that he is bald. And I did not know that. So anyway, well... At least we found love. So that's all I can say. Also, can you people stop coming to my house? Because no one invited you. Oh, well, if you're going to do my dishes, I really don't mind. So let's... um. Let's brighten your day. Let's give you a sales pitch. Let's give you a heartfelt compliment. Ask, no, we don't want to ask to cloud gaze. So definitely do not want to cloud gaze with you. But I mean, we want to do nice things for you. And I don't know why we still haven't seen... <laughs> we still haven't seen any sort of like... We haven't made any progress in the friend of the neighborhood. So I don't know about that. Can you buy something, please? Please. Please buy something. Let's uh, try this again. Let's confuse you. Oh, geez. That actually looked really weird. Come on. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, she looks very upset. Come on, grab our beautiful baked goods. Look at that. Look at that bread. Who doesn't want freshly baked bread? Also, I need to get this. This new, brand new. Look how happy she looks, guys. She's positively glowing. I don't know if it's her makeover or her newfound love. Hmm, what do you guys think it is? Why do you think she's glowing so much and she looks so excited? Guys, we've got eight minutes left of this episode. I feel like the time goes so fast and we haven't even touched the renovations. But we have a boyfriend. We have a boyfriend and he is super in love with us, guys. Can you buy something? Okay, well, thank you, Art. Thank you very much for, you know... He is pretty cool. We were also dating, by the way, because you're a mean person. And you were leading us on for no reason. Thank you for buying something. Now, buy something else. Come on. You're rich. You can you can afford it. Let's uh, give you a sales pitch. Give me a sales pitch again. Friendly. No, okay. Well, we'll do it twice, and then if you don't want it, we'll go. Okay, just, just go, please. I think this is why we don't like each other, because you are just annoying, actually. If you don't want me to give you a sales pitch, what do you want me to do? Do you just want me to stand here? Because I, I feel like every time I give you people a sales pitch, can you leave? Can I ask you to leave? Because you actually just... You're just taking up my time, and I could be selling items. So go away. Stop talking to me. Go away. Let's give a sales pitch to you. Go away. Well, thank you, Kingo, because... Gosh, news travels fast in this city, guys. No, what do you mean you're leaving? Are you... You know what? I'm not going to give any more sales pitches to anyone. Can you just leave? Go away. I don't want you here. Just go. This is, oh my goodness, this woman is so annoying. I heard you and Art started dating. I'm pretty sure you already sent me a message saying that, but okay. I mean, we'll do whatever we need. Giselle is burning to death. What? Let's, um... Take a cold shower? How about that? How, and wait, is our thing not on anymore? Is it a heat wave? Oh, it is a heat wave, guys. Um, so let's start the yard sale. I can't believe we only did two. We only sold two items. We still need to sell the other two, and then I can. 
you can't be serious that I'm still burning to you know what we are going to close this we are going to clear the table clear the table stop talking to all these weird people okay and then I want you to outfit change it to the nude then go take a cold shower and then we'll stay inside for the rest of the day how about that okay I think that's good let's kick all these people out can everyone okay well we've got a positivity challenge I don't know how to do this so usual sim cell yeah we already did that and then Millie Bobby Brown said what did she say to us Giselle has learned about the blah 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 succeeding in the positivity challenge requires you perform an assortment of kind generous and sweet tasks for other sims be friendly towards other sims or perform helpful deeds for your neighbors anything that spreads the positive energy after completing a stage of the aspiration be sure to open a box of kindness to receive a reward so let's go be friendly to a bunch of people let's um is she sleeping okay well there's still a bunch of people in her house and if they don't leave I'm definitely gonna lock this door and just kill you all how about that I think that's a brilliant idea guys because these damn people do not know their boundaries okay so let's uh, stock table there's nothing oh is it still in me Ooh, uh, let's do inventory got 18 hours okay that's that's pretty good stock table it is still pretty hot outside but I'm almost a hundred percent sure that this late I fancy secure yes we do but I, I need to do this so I need to start my yard sale please don't cancel before I've sold these two items how about that how about I meet you there later but oh goodness we're gonna have to um, invite him out with us I think because he did invite us and then we didn't say anything so we don't want to lose our new boyfriend okay cool so we have sold every single item in our bake sale so fantastic and we also want to just quit our job because this job sucks anyway so let's quit job and cool and then what we're going to do is Okay, quit, quit our job so we're unemployed. Yes. Oh no, wait, we don't want to join a career, we want to register a company. So I know that's the, one of the new things. No, go away. That's one of the new things that we had. We can register with the Ministry of Labor. So what we're going to do is. Oh, she's so professional. Look, you so cute. Uh, we are a baker. And our job description is we make we bake delicious goods. Our cookies bring the boys to the yard. Okay, well not really guys, but we're not gonna tell them that. Okay, so our cookies bring the boys to the yard. Did I just say okay, I did spell that right because I have a bad habit of never spelling anything right. And yeah that's it so hello a little baker thank you so much for being so amazing can you all just get out of my house because I don't understand about all these sims in our houses but anyway ask about day we're just gonna be friendly because oh, we don't want to ooh, no we're not we're not going we are definitely not going to be ruining our relationship with our amazing art Chavi's new boyfriend. We definitely, definitely not doing that. Uh, let's let's all watch TV together. How about that? How about we watch TV and chat because my fun needs to be going up. There we go. So he's a mixologist. Tell unbelievable story. We want to be friendly. I don't know if we can. How about we give a gift? I mean, that's a nice thing to do. So let's give her a gift. Oh, wait, friendly gift. Ooh, can I breed my frogs quickly? I mean, I don't mind giving you a frog, but at the moment, I mean, I don't. I can give you a simoleon gift. Ooh, 100, 100 simoleons. That's a lot of money. 
Come on, this has got to give me a poster. Come on, give me a poster. That's a nice gift. I was super nice. Okay, no. Well, obviously, that did not, um, that did not work at all. I don't ask about another sim. Let's ask about art. Let's see what she has to say about our future husband. Let's see what she says. Giselle can now perform a smooth apology and a cheerful introduction on other sims. Well, that's cool. Which charisma level four? I think we're a people's person, guys. I haven't had the pleasure of meeting Art. Okay, fantastic. We're gonna go to bed. You guys can do whatever the hell you want to do. I really don't mind. My house seems to be the communal place, and I still don't have a poster, so I mean, there's that. So I don't. Sims players around the world have collected. Wow, so many posters, guys. I don't know. If you guys know an easy way for us to get some posters, then um, let me know down below in the comment section. I don't know what we're supposed to actually do. I wonder if you can, like, go here. No, you can't, like, just go to someone's house and be like, hey, do you need anything? Maybe I must go to their houses to do something for them. Not 100% sure. But... I hear there's a great party going down at the nightclub. No, we don't. We're sleeping. Go away. This is not a booty call. You may not phone me after 10 p.m. That is just ridiculous art. Come on. I thought you were better than that. We are not about to accept that. We're a lady. You phone us in the day. And bring flowers too. If you come to my house and you're ringing the doorbell with your hands, there's something wrong with you because your arms better be full of gifts. Okay, guys, that sounded really bad. I'm not really like that. I just, that was a joke. So please don't at me. Please don't at me. Let's see what we can get. Uh, we, we just really want to collect a whole bunch of stuff. I really want a lot of money. I think we'll do the renovations in the next video. We'll just uh, go over and see what we can do. I have been trying to get used to the terrain tools. It's because of the newness of it. We haven't had it in The Sims 4 since its release and now we've got it and it's a little bit more difficult. I've been playing around with the different leveled rooms but if they're connected they don't stay at different levels. They automatically snap to the same level on the grid. So that's a little bit frustrating because it would have been so nice to have connecting rooms at different heights. You know like sunken lounges I guess you can still do it with the, you know, removing the foundations. If you're raising the foundations, you can still do that. That's always been possible in The Sims 4. But I was just uh, hoping we'd have a little bit more freedom with that. But obviously, it is a new feature. We can't really expect too much. So we're going to breed this frog with itself. Thank you. We'll sell all these beauties. We are trying to complete a collection so I am opening off or extracting all fossils incoming phone call hi Giselle it's me do you want to go on a date no thank you we do not want to go on a date because it is the middle of the night come on now what a weird guy let's see if we have found anything new so let's send that to the geo council let's open this up Okay, so we found two common trophies. That's perfectly fine. And sell this frog. I think we have a decent amount of money for ne next episode. I mean, we've got three and a half thousand. That's that's pretty good. So while she bakes these, I um, I feel like we should go on a date, guys. We wanted to do that in the other episode, and we weren't able to because we have very bad luck on dates. So let's take our new boyfriend out on a wonderful romantic date. How about that? I think that's a good idea. And then we'll end this episode at the end of our date. So let's go to... Uh, where is... No, 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 no. Sam Maishino. We'll go to this old salt house. Oh my goodness. Uh, okay. Um... I still haven't placed down a restaurant, which I guess is my own fault. 
Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm so frustrated right now because now we have nowhere to go. Let's go to the park. Let's let's go to the park here in Oasis Springs. We'll cook some food, have some things on the grill, just chill a little bit in the park. I think that's a cute little date. We can do that. We definitely don't want to go to nightclubs because we don't want him to think that we're that kind. Of. Okay, listen. Those shoes, though. This... We, you are so lucky we never met you outside of this because it's this is absolutely ridiculous your fashion choice okay it's no better than mine but still I don't ugh, let's just make out with you we at least have love guys we can't actually just complain at all kiss him oh so cute you two Look at you, oh, we're so excited, guys. Okay, so they are very flirty. We do want to get them in a funny mood. We tell them a dirty joke. No kiss. No, 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 no. We want to. We want to get him playful. So passionate kiss, fantastic. Come on, playful. We want to get you playful. Oh, yeah, that's so cute, guys. Oh, jeez. My camera angles. Wow. Um, I don't know how I feel about this, guys. It's just... We're not going to propose. That's, that's a bit too far. Come on, now. Come on, Sims. We just met this guy, like, yesterday. We found out he was bald this morning when he woke up in our house. There's definitely not going to be any marriage just yet. I think we'll wait. Uh, we're about to um, age up into an adult. I think I, you know, I do want to. We're about to age up into an adult, guys, and it's a little bit of a problem because. When you have a baby at this age, oh wait, it is her birthday today. Oh no, we have to have a birthday party, guys. <laughs> we can't not have a birthday party. That would be so sad. Giselle will be our birthday girl. Let's invite all of our friends and non-friends and boyfriend and whoever we know. We know actually quite a lot of people because of the bake sale. Let me invite everyone. Okay, cool. We've got 15 guests coming. That's that's really cool. We'll hire it. Got a... Did we hire that role? Yes. We are not going to hire a mixologist or an entertainer. That's just ridiculous. And we will do it here at this park. So what is this? The park is called... Data Boom Park. The time now is 10 a.m. So how about we make it for 2 p.m.? I think that's good. Okay, cool. And how about we grill some veggie burgers and we have a meal together? I think that's a good idea. Come on over here and talk to me. I mean, why don't you carry on talking to me while I cook? We can talk and cook at the same time. Hey. Okay. I'm very excited for her because... You know, we really did struggle in the last time, and it was just so horrible. Can you please get playful? Because, you know, we... we wait, why would you do that, Giselle? Let's grab a serving together. Let's have some food. Some food. Let's break bread in our new relationship. Okay, let's, okay we don't need to either. How in sync are they, guys? They were completely made for each other. They were definitely made for each other. Okay, no. He ruined it. He ruined it. Ooh. Hello. Bow, 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 bow. Yes. Oh, um... Guys, I, I need to get used to this because it's quite, um... It's quite hectic. It's... Okay. Have a deep conversation. So friendly, uh, deep conversation. Oh, 
Why would you just push your head forward like that? Oh, that looks cool. Let's have a deep conversation again just to, you know, get our uh, friendship up as well. What is going on? I promise you guys I'm not looking up in the sky. She is. It's just crazy. So when you click on something, you can't actually control. Oh, jeez, I can't do this. Oh, that's making me so sick. If you guys are watching this at home and you're just making you sick, I apologize. Also, I'm going to end this episode here. So thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe. I upload videos daily. And turn on the bell notifications if you'd like to be notified when I upload new videos. So if you join us tomorrow, we will watch... Their, her beautiful birthday party so let's hope that it's a good birthday she has found love so we're very excited for her it's taken her her whole young adult life to find this boyfriend and let's see um let's see what happens okay all we can do is see what happens when you know we get there. So, yes, thank you guys for watching so much. I'll see you tomorrow. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you. Goodbye.